Now we're going up to have our morning swim because the hotel here has actually a swimming pool. So let's go up to the swimming pool. Okay, good morning, Thursday 29th of November, we're here in Patea. So we're uh, up on the rooftop, just been swimming here. On the rooftop here, first time I've been swimming up on the uh, top of a hotel before, so that was quite good. Yeah, so now we're here. I'm not sure whether we're just spending the morning here or we're spending a day here, we're not sure yet. It depends on uh, whether we can take the ferry or not, so we'll see. But first we'll just have some breakfast, then we'll go and uh, speak to the ferry people. So, uh, yeah. So uh, we'll see what happens today. Well, it's only lunchtime, but the bars are already getting full up. It's a bit strange here in uh, this town because uh, the, there are lots of men there uh, with uh, young ladies, and that is a bit strange when. Uh, when normal people like us, we never have seen that, so we think uh, it's normal just to be the sage. But here, it's different, very different. Mm. Interesting place. So now it's time for a haircut in Thailand this time. <laughs> Tried many countries now. This is the first time in Thailand. Now Daddy is checking into the ferry station because now we will have. A, we want to have a ferry from this town. Pattaya city to the north side of the sea here because we want to skip Bangkok so that is why we want to cross the sea here so we skip Bangkok okay we're in luck that just shows sometimes it's actually better to turn up in person and talk to somebody that uh, seems to help so uh, yeah tomorrow we can take this uh, nice boat there all the way to a place called Ho He and um, it's on the opposite side of uh, the bay here means we'll miss out on Bangkok and miss out on uh, four days cycling. So of course the most important is that we avoid cycling through uh, the center of Bangkok. So that's extremely good. So that'll give us uh, four days more in uh, Phuket maybe, let's see, <laughs> on the nicer side of the uh, of the bay here. That was great. We just have to turn up here at 12 o'clock and uh, hope they let us on when they see all our bags. Now they've only seen our bikes but we'll show them a picture of all the bags. So let's hope. Uh, so now we are going to the massage. Yeah, then we'll try some massage, whatever. <laughs> yeah, then we'll do that. There seems to be lots of massage places here. So we go to the right point of massage place. <laughs> this is the first sign of Christmas on this trip here. It doesn't feel like Christmas here, but here they have a huge Christmas tree outside the Hilton Hotel here. Nice Christmas tree. New virtual reality for Jamie. You ready? Yes. And this, this is what Jamie can see now. Okay, now he's flying. should have English breakfast. Let's go and have a look. Okay, good morning. This has turned into our favorite uh, restaurant here in Pattaya. This is the Pig and Whistle English pub here in uh, Pattaya. So we've been here for fish and chips and breakfast yesterday and now we're back again for more yeah. English breakfast. And now we are seeing uh, old boxing where Michael Tyson had 
Tyson. Michael Tyson. Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson was playing, and this is one of the matches. But not him this time. Oh, this is an old one. 84, this one. Oh, this is the street here, just where the English pub is, but here, you now it's all very quiet here. You walk down here in the night time or the evening, this is just full of uh, women here, Thai ladies <laughs> looking for work. Now it's all very quiet. This is the place where all the girls are, but not now. Because now it's totally quiet. And uh, the girls here, I think they go after the Europeans because they think they are very rich. That is like, this is like the only like tourist place where all the, where all the witch, some of the witch tourist men, they go, come here and find the old. Okay, so hello. Friday, 30th of November today. Just, uh, yeah, left the hotel here now, back on the bikes, and now we just go into the uh, ferry port. So that was the end of our, we spent one day here yesterday in Patea. Um, this is probably the uh, biggest red light town we visited on this trip. We've been in mainly uh, Muslim countries for most of the trip, so we didn't see anything uh, of this kind in all of those countries. But here it's a completely different world. So uh, yeah, lots of uh, elderly Western men, actually quite a few younger men also from India we saw here. And literally uh, hundreds and hundreds of girls along the seafront here in all the bars <laughs> looking for work. So uh, yeah, but, uh, there's a nice atmosphere here. We found a nice hotel and there's a nice uh, pub street where there's a few bars and uh, rock music and different things so yeah we actually had a good time but uh, the most important thing here was that we could get tickets for the ferry so we managed to do that yesterday so now we just go to the ferry and then we'll say to we'll sail to a town called Ho Hin it's called Hoi Hin I think it's called there so uh, it'll be a few hours sailing or save us four days cycling through Bangkok so that's good so yeah okay let's uh, cycle down the front here and go to the ferry port allow me to show you something <laughs> Right along the seafront here, on the right here, this is where you just see many, many girls here in the evening <laughs> looking for work. So this is Pop Street here. It's all very uh, peaceful now at this time of the day. But, uh, in the evening here, it's a completely different story. We've only been here early in the evening. It be even more crazy as you get late into the night. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. This is where we saw the rock music. Twice now there, it's a good place. Indian restaurants, quite a few Indian restaurants, quite a few Indian men that come here, Indian disco. Even Ronald McDonald's. That's the view of Patea here on the pier where we're taking the ferry. yesterday said we could. We only load two bags each so what we've done we put our, our bags that we put into these uh, simple plastic bags again so we only have two bags and so we've got over on that and they allow us on the ferry.
crossed over from one side of the bay to the other. That was great. Nice ferry crossing. So uh, excellent. Now we're here. We just find a yeah, place to stay and then uh, ready to get cycling in the morning. This is how we do when uh, we are on the ferry. We just take some two bags, big bags, and put all our bags down in it so it don't look like it's uh, so much. And uh, yeah, so now we are uh, wiped with the new town and it's look very good. And so yes, excellent now. Completely different feeling of an Nissan head from the, where we just came from. So we're just staying here. That's the little room there. Very simple. Nice and quiet. Okay, it doesn't take long to move into these uh, kind of chalets here. It's very easy for cyclists. Well, let's go and see what the beach looks like here. Looks like the sun is just going down. Uh, here we can catch a bit of a uh, sunset swimming. Oh, new day, new beach. Let's see what this one looks like. Here, in the wind. Very easy. The name of this place is Luna Hot Resort. Okay, so that was the end of uh, two days. One day yesterday in uh, Patea, and uh, now we crossed over the Gulf of Thailand to Hua Hin, I think it's called. <laughs> yeah, tomorrow we're back on the bikes, cycling along the coast, along the Gulf of Thailand. So, okay, that was it. Uh, see you tomorrow on the bikes. Thank you.